Welcome back. 614 on your Tuesday morning. A much better day out there than we had yesterday. But yesterday afternoon, it yeah. ended up being okay. It really did, at least in the lower valley. A lot mm. of us didn't get a whole lot of rain in the afternoon. And yeah. actually, I went out uh, last evening around 6, 630. A little bit of a jog. Actually, Not it felt too bad. pretty good. Yeah. It was humid in the afternoon when it I was. left. And then the dew points came down in the evening, and we're kind of picking up where we left off. So certainly okay. more comfortable out there. Mm -hmm. But we picked up a lot of rain yesterday morning. At least some of us. I was going to say most of us. But, you know, those of us in Springfield and Points East, yeah, we had some downpours. But it was really Franklin County, Hampshire County, the Berkshires. We saw two to five inches of rainfall. And that was just from uh, yesterday morning's rain, I should say. And, of course, we had the rain over the weekend. All that rain piling up and pouring into uh, the rivers and the streams. And, of course, uh, maybe making it problematic with river levels uh, running high. And here's the overview. You know, the first number here right here is when you go into flood stage. And we're pretty close now. In uh, Northampton, this is uh, the Connecticut River at Northampton, and it's forecast to go into moderate flood stage this afternoon. And as we go into tonight, it's going to crest, and then it will come down. And really, that's the case at Holyoke, uh, Montague as well. So the rivers will continue to rise as we go through the day today, cresting late tonight into tomorrow morning. Then they'll start to subside after that. And we should dry out today, tomorrow as well. We're not expecting much of any rainfall. There could be an isolated storm tomorrow evening uh, north of Route 2. But a nice day on tap for today. We have some leftover clouds, but it is less humid. We'll see a decent amount of sunshine today. It's going to be a nice day to be sitting by the pool. Just a few clouds mixed in this morning and then quite a bit of sunshine as we go into the afternoon. A couple of clouds might mix in. Temperatures today will reach into the middle and upper 80s. There'll be a nice breeze. So it is going to be warm, but it will be less humid with dew points near 60. And with lower levels of humidity, we can cool off more efficiently. So overnight tonight, will be down into the low to mid-60s, so it should be a nice night for sleeping. Nice start to our day tomorrow. Nice day overall, but a few clouds mix in in the afternoon, and we'll be up near 90 tomorrow. So we do have a few warm days on the way, but not overly humid. This twist in the atmosphere, this area of low pressure, it's right about in here now over northern parts of New England as it slowly drifts away, still bringing rainfall to parts of Vermont, which, of course, have picked up uh, copious amounts of rain. And that's not good for us either, right, because all that rain in Vermont and Hampshire drains into the Connecticut River, and that's why it's going to be continuing to run high and still rising over the next uh, 24 hours or so. So your weather headlines, less humid today and tomorrow. Humidity builds in starting Thursday, and then it looks like more showers and thunderstorms late Thursday. And as we go into Friday, Friday may end up being a first alert weather day. We'll have to monitor potential for some fl flooding on Friday with more rain on the way. Dew points in the 50s to near 60, a little bit of mugginess, but certainly more comfortable. Humidity starts to build in on Thursday and with low pressure heading our way Friday. That may end up being a first alert weather day. That is your next weather maker with low pressure. Late Thursday, Thursday night into Friday, we'll have some showers, some downpours. We'll watch out for some more bands of heavy rainfall as low pressure and a slow moving front heads our way for Friday. So again, that may end up being a first alert weather day. We can't rule out probably some thunderstorms, maybe a strong storm mixed in there as well. We'll time out the rain as we draw closer to it. That Friday looks problematic, and then we should dry out somewhat, probably still humid over the weekend, but rain chances will go down as we head into the weekend. Can't rule out a shower or a storm. All right, more weather in a couple minutes. Time now is 617. Amanda, back over to you. Ten,